Health Matters Now. Health experts say there is need to urgently put strategies in place to prevent an importation of the wild polio virus type 1 following its recent outbreak in Malawi. This formed the crux of discussions at the 38th Expert Review Committee meeting on polio and routine immunization in Abuja. A correspondent, Kemi Balogun, has more details in the story. Nigeria has fought a long and hard battle with the wild polio virus before its certification as a free country in August 2020. But now there is a lingering threat to this certification if strategies are not put in place to prevent an outbreak. This is the first meeting of the Expert Review Committee after two years. Since then, Nigeria has steadily improved on routine immunization from 33% coverage in 2016 to 56% in 2022. This meeting, we'll be talking about all of those strategies that we need to implement, uh, what are the kinds of resources that we need to mobilize uh, to make sure that uh, uh, we maintain a resilient uh, system uh, that will be able to detect any importation of wild polio viruses. The committee will be expected to produce recommendations that will guide in halting the outbreak of the circulating vaccine-derived polio virus type 2, as well as how to scale up both routine immunization and COVID-19 vaccination coverages. The objective called for this committee is essentially to advise on strategies to prevent reintroduction of wild polio virus in Nigeria and end the circulating vaccine-derived polio virus in Nigeria through strengthening of the immunization program, EFP surveillance, community mobilization and advocacy, environmental monitoring, and other appropriate strategies. So we're hopeful that as we increase coverage for uh, COVID-19 vaccination, we'll also increase routine uh, immunization. That will go a long way uh, in making sure that we're able to contain this outbreak of uh, circulating variant polio viruses. But it's very, very important that the states take leadership, that our governors, that our commissioners for health, executive secretaries take leadership because we cannot do it from Abuja. Experts here highlight the need to keep the momentum going and find better ways of improving strategies to surpassed the 71% achievement reached within two years before the pandemic began. Strengthening immunization through community mobilization and advocacy has been identified as one way to cut down on polio outbreaks. Kemi Balogun, TVC News, Abuja.